Today in Draw My Life, the real story of Dumbo. Jumbo started laughing. My final act has begun. We all know the movie Dumbo. It tells the story of the little elephant with huge ears. But is that his real story? Legend has it that his real name was Jumbo, and he was a young boy who lived in a circus with his parents, a tightrope walker, and an elephant tamer named Timothy. The circus was a living hell for Jumbo. He was the target of mockery and abuse from other kids his age, because Jumbo had one unique trait. He had the biggest ears in town. Jumbo hated the circus and begged his father, Timothy, to send him to live with his grandparents. But his father refused and forced him to learn the tamer's craft to carry on the family legacy. So he named him Trainee Tamer of a young elephant who was born quite recently. Jumbo grew fond of the little elephant who also had the same trait, huge ears. Like every night at, like every night at the circus, Jumbo watched his parents show from backstage. But one night, something unfortunate happened. His mother, in the middle of a balancing act with the elephants, felt and was crushed by one of them, dying a few seconds later. Jumbo, in panic, tried to attack the elephants with a broken bottle, but his father stopped him. Realizing that he could have taken revenge at that moment, he took a few bottles of whiskey from a crate and went to drink in the street. Jumbo ended up passed out on the road. He then woke up to the rain that was starting to pour down, got up as best as he could, and headed for the tent where the elephants were. There, he found his father feeding them. What are you doing with those monsters? said Jumbo. He didn't understand why his father was taking care of the elephants after what had happened. They're not to blame. It was an accident. Jumbo flew into a rage, grabbed a torch, threw it into the hay, and set it on fire. What have you done? His father said to him as he ran away after releasing the elephant from the fire. Jumbo started laughing. My final act has begun. The woods of the tent began to fall, and the fire surrounded him while he laughed. When they managed to put out the fire, they found Jumbo's lifeless body. But he wasn't alone. The little elephant lay beside him in an attempt to protect his friend. Soon after, Timothy disappeared. Only a diary was found in his caravan, where on all its pages were written, I'm guilty, except on the last page where the word Dumbo was written. Now you know the story behind Dumbo. Do you want to see any other real stories on the channel? Leave it in the comments and don't forget to subscribe. See you soon.